much love and appreciation to those of you who have been with me for the two year period plus that I've been doing this. Um, thank you for showing your uh, love and support to the channel and to anybody else who is brand new to the platform and you would like to support the channel. Also, you can do it by way of Patreon, Anchor, the clothing store, and also the shoe shop that is listed in the comment description below. And again, thank you to any and all of you guys who have been here to support this channel during the two plus year period i wouldn't be able to do what i do every single day without you so before 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 we even make it into this video youtube to anybody who is clearly looking or whatever it is that y'all happen to do behind the screens at your computers at home whatever um, just note that this is not trying to spread any type of nonsense. Um, this is a critique of the nonsense that is within this video. This is not trying to quote unquote broadcast it or have other people believe the ideologies. Like for whatever reason, y'all seem to believe that I'm trying to spread this stuff out. Nah, it's a simple critique. And it's also making people aware of the types of individuals, right? that are directly out here that in a sense want to follow this type of crap like i said people need to be made aware of the things that are out here and the things that are taking place and the things that people are specifically talking about that could potentially lead right to a loss of life right like we saw at the tops uh supermarket or what we sat up there and saw take place in Texas and so on and so on and so on. Like I said, people need to be made aware of these things. Thank you all for coming, everyone. Uh, I'm Honorable Chairman Simon, and it's a leader, Elijah, and this is the first meeting of the White Student Coalition. Hello comrades, um, thank you for coming, and I just wanted to start the meeting off this first meeting of the White Student Coalition with a century-old ritual. The legionaries of Romania would use this ritual to honor and ponder the sacrifices of their fallen comrades. So, comrade Cornelius Zella Tajirianu. Present! Comrade Mussolini. Present. Comrade Rockwell. Present. Comrade Hitler. Present. Comrades, there is a guest for situation in every white nation. Our women are being Our inheritance is being stolen by hordes of brown aliens who have no stock in our nations. They are destroying us and we do nothing about it but invite them in. No more. We have to stand up, and we are. That's why we're here. It's not so funny when we think of all the members of the law. What's something that people are not ready to hear? White women are the biggest hindrance to moving racial equality forward because we have more influence over the raising of our children than anybody else, and white supremacy grows in our homes. And we are the ones teaching our children if only they would behave this way, speak this way, or dress this way, maybe they would have equality. And I will not argue this with anyone. Well, depending on how this video went, you either got a comment section or the video is not going to be seen or YouTube decided to do the same stuff that they do all the time. It just so happened to take down the video because usually YouTube does not happen to listen to any of the things that I say before a video just so happens to start. So, hey, we don't know what's going to happen here. Um, but just so happens if this video did actually make it, you were literally able to hear right true american kids stating that you know there are groups of people that are you know being um you know placed here uh and they're not adding directly anything to america they're simply taking from america aka taking from them right this is why they call themselves the white student coalition right and they were having their meetings and you know and different things of that nature and they were having their little hand signs and gestures and all of these other types of things like i said this is a um pretty dangerous thing right this is why i had the caucasian woman ahead of time 
basically stating uh who is in a sense the ones that enable this type of behavior enable this type of ideology who foster and care for this type of ideology it is them right and then i further try to put that into perspective right when it comes into um you know more so specifically black women and you know them wanting to basically state that you know none of this innocence exists right that these types of guys would be the ones that's going to you know love them care for them take care of, you know all that great stuff right even though realistically it doesn't make any sense since these would be the types that would actually be against all of your people not not just <laughs> not just you know a a, a, a soul group everybody also including you it, it, it just depends on uh that time and that place right where they have to make that decision at this moment you know they don't really have to side with anybody or make that decision they can just live in a gray area and that's what a lot of uh these young boys right who grow up into you know full-fledged teens who grow up into a full-fledged male adults that's what they do they play the game of being a chameleon where they basically live in this gray area up until the point that you know whatever alarms or whatever goes off and then you're going to see exactly who they are at the end of the day and that's the other reason why i you know placed this video out there because like i said you will have teens like this amongst black kids in the black communities but nobody knows about it because they're doing this in their homes they're doing this at camp they're doing this at their friend's house uh, uh in the suburbs or or out in the woods somewhere whatever it is or in their basements like they're doing this outside of the view of black people so therefore nobody black is going to know that this is the type of people that happen to live around them that they're going to school with that uh, uh they're shopping with that they're driving by right that you're walking by in the streets you're not going to know that up until like i said before that alarm or whatever it is magically goes off and then you know it is what it is but like i said before these types need to be showcased so that other people out there are fully aware of the inherent dangers that are persistent and that are present and that are around a variety of people throughout their day as they walk in life and if things like this aren't in a sense showcased on social media or they just so happen to be silenced for whatever small reasons it is basically showcasing that you have a variety of other individuals that are protecting that are enabling that are fostering right this type of ideology and allowing it to flourish because they're not allowing other people to highlight specifically what it is and also i want to highlight you know you have some people out there that just might want to roll by and they want to start talking about you know black people and how come you don't focus on black people this and black people that and black people this i got you no problem i, I, I got somebody that's going to speak on that real quick talk about black killing black Okay, but then let's talk about whites. Let's talk about whites killing whites, whites killing blacks, whites killing Asians, whites killing gays, whites killing anybody that's not white, and then also whites killing white people. Let's talk about whites who are child pornographers. Let's talk about white pedophiles. Let's talk about white human trafficking rings. Let's talk about white drug dealers. Let's talk about white corporate crime. Let's talk about white serial killers that are shooting up churches, shooting up movie theaters, shooting up shopping malls, shooting up children's schools. Let's talk about the white deranged people that hide children and women in their basements and chain them up and keep them enslaved and abuse them and beat them okay and then impregnate them for years let's talk about that let's talk about the white terrorists like just what happened january 6th at the at the capitol building let's talk about all that 